says there is a possibility, he's Muslim, there is a possibility he will listen, then I have to tell him by using words and sometimes facial, you know, expressions. Okay, so there are some ahadith about the importance of enjoining good and forbidding evil. The Prophet says, my community will continue to be blessed as long as they enjoin the good and forbid the evil and help one another in good deeds. When they do not do this, blessings will be withheld from them and some evil persons among them will have hegemony over the others and they shall have no helper neither on earth, on the earth nor in heaven. Another hadith the Imam Ja'far al-Sadiq alayhi salam quoting the Messenger of Allah as saying, How will it be with you when your women will become corrupt and your youth sinful, while you will not be enjoining the good nor forbidding the evil? The people said, Will this happen, O Messenger of Allah? He replied, Yes, and even worse than that. How will it be with you when you will be enjoining enjoining the evil and forbidding the good. The people said, O oh, Messenger of Allah, will this actually happen? He says, yes, and even worse than that. How will it be when with you, when you will think of good as evil and of evil as good? <laughs> it, it seems that now, now that some evil, we call it what? Art. It's art. 